Hey guys, it's Ryan from jrocks.com. i um, here today to uh, go through a, another tutorial for a gym. Um, today we're going to focus on showing you just how easy it is to create and edit the home page part of the gem software. Uh, this option allows you to create uh, customized home pages so it doesn't always look like a store. You can even uh, put any you know any type of text and images on the front home page without any any knowledge of HTML or uh, web design. So here we go. First off, uh, we have to log into our gem admin area. Uh, from here, you want you would want to first go to content manage content so that we can edit the home page. Right here we've added some uh, example blog entries but for the time being we're gonna do a simple test of the edit of editing the home page so I click on the actions button now notice uh, let's go through and I'll show you the, the default layout basically the the default layout of the gem store is uh, looks somewhat like this we've already pre-populated it with with uh, products and uh, essentially a lot of the online shopping carts really have a a very basic storefront um, that allows you to you know that shows pretty much just you know products and uh, you can't really do much of anything else as far as editing that 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 home page uh, with gem it's a little bit more uh, advanced and you get uh, you get you're able to edit this directly from the J uh, jam admin area so let's go back to our admin side. Here in the content area, you notice there's a basic the HTML editor. So just to show you quickly how this works is we'll just you know type in uh, basic uh, message here. Okay, click submit. Now notice this is this is still in the store format, so you'll see, you'll be able to see that the message comes up right at the top there. Now there's a there's a couple of different options for editing the gem homepage. What you're gonna have to do is the first you know, you can you can come in here and if you want to keep that that format where it displays the products, you can. You can also upload a photo there if you just want to upload it. Let's do a test one here. We already have this this test photo, so why don't we go ahead and just add this, center it, and okay. Now you'll see we'll reload it. It'll show up right on top. See, of all the products for the store, for the store format. Now. There's a couple more options you you also uh, may want. If you, for example, don't want to show the store products on the home page, you can you can select a different format by going to Design Site Layout. And here in the default home page option, the default uh, is Store. So if you want to just create your own home page, you can do that by just selecting Home Page and click submit so let's go back notice it'll just you know, hit refresh notice the products disappear now you only have the photo there you can go even a step further by creating a completely custom home page layout just by removing the left and right columns so now it's set, it's set, as you can see it's on the home page under the home page section you hide the left and right columns and refresh see now you can see just how just how much uh, flexibility you have in the gem software for editing the, the, your, your own storefront um, you, you know you can go back now to the content and uh, edit the home page button home page section click on edit again here now you can pretty much put anything you want here you know you can Create your own custom home custom home page. 
custom text pictures photos uh, if you want to put a video here you can as well um, you know if you want to put a YouTube video you can so you click submit um, I mean you know you can pretty much uh, edit the home the home page however you want so that you know you you can create a a fairly um, professional professional style home page without having any knowledge of uh, of HTML or programming um, but you know if if you also ha if you also uh, have some HTML knowledge and you want to customize this even more you can you can do that as well um, you know the the, the the editor here in uh, the HTML editor here allows you to um, edit the uh, HTML source so if you want to do that you can you know you can type hand code HTML or if you want HTML code if you want um, you know so you can do it that way too and another option that you you also have is if you click on design site layout if you have a uh, custom page that you want users to be redirected to all the time um, you can put that home page right here well so you know for example uh, let's say let's just go to one of our content pages for instance I would like all uh, for whatever reason I would like people who visit my home page to always go to this particular article all you have to do is copy and paste that link right here in the design site layout section custom home page redirect save it now every time somebody goes to your home page it'll be redirected right back to this page so if you have a custom splash page or something like that that you like to use that people get redirected to that's you know just as easy just by adding the link right here okay um, one final thing if you want to create a blog a blog style page where you know your content uh, gets listed right on the front you would uh, select content for the default home page option in the design site layout area if you see this you click on content or select content and we go back to our home page here notice it has still has the custom you know header that you you might want to put up there but it lists you know, your articles so if you want to have a blog style layout you can do that um, so let's just play with this a little bit so we'll show the left column for the home page section and uh, let's delete this so you guys can see a little bit better submit now let's uh, refresh this now you this should show the left column along with all your articles so this is now your home page and you still have your store where people can click to and browse and shop and all that but you can see just how just how awesome really um, the design um, elements are in gem so you can really customize your home your uh, website you know fairly easy without having to know you know so much coding but if you also would like to you know customize it with the more advanced stuff you also can um, it's fairly extensive so anyway that's the short tutorial now um, I guess uh, I'll talk to you guys again soon in another ch uh, tutorial bye